So how did you guys all meet each other and decide to form Remote Control? We actually met at a club, this club uh, in Atlanta that everybody goes to, like this big dance club, um, where like most of the dancers go to. We met, uh, I've seen him there, but I didn't actually meet him until we uh, went to a competition where these two competed uh, in the finals. Um, and after that, that's when we all kind of, where we knew each other. Um, and then we auditioned for a different TV show um, we had a different crew, we had a different crew, crews didn't work, and then we decided to form our own crew for another show, and then once we formed that, we just been going ever since. What are your big inspirations that you have? Well, for me, uh, my biggest inspiration is these guys. When I watch, like, how dope a robot can be, I just decided to go with it, and then, like, just meeting with other dancers is just... And just keeps me going because of how they love the dance. The dance culture, just the way, it's like the dance culture has their own world that's separate from reality, you know what I'm saying? Like everybody, they go to jams, they go to events, and it's like they just, you just do what you what you love to do, you know what I'm saying? You just get out there and dance, and that is what drove me. So I used to, I, I battle, that's why I started dancing, it, is in competitions and stuff. And that's what I fell in love with first, and then it started going to performing and making a living out of it, so I would have to say, just the dance culture is what's inspired me to keep keep dancing. What made this genre of music appeal to you guys? It was new, it was hot, and it just fit with dance so well because what dubstep brings to the actual look of the performance, like you have your regular like music that everybody dances to, and that's what's been going on for the longest, you know what I'm saying? So when this new music came out and it was fresh on the scene, we were like, okay, we gotta jump on this. Like, it just captures the audience like nothing else does. What kind of crazy events do you guys have planned for this year? We have a few shows in Atlanta lined up. We have some, a lot of halftime shows for, for the NBA. Doing a lot more overseas work this year too, so. Also, Chibi has a movie coming out. He's gonna be the lead role in this, uh, what's it called? Pinocchio. Pinocchio movie, yeah, so. This is Remote Control, Control and, and you're, you're rocking, rocking with 207 Nightlife. Nightlife.